It starts as a conversation, like what is it? What's it going to do? How much power should it have? And we just kind of build a skeleton of the features that, it, that this product should have. We had a, a pretty complete line of products. You know, we go all the way from charging phones to running fridges, right? And that's one of the things that we're known for. So we realized there was a pretty strong need for a USB only product. We really wanted to hit the adventure person. I had probably 10 different sketches and computer models and explored so many different options uh, trying to get the right design for the Venture 30. The direction we went though was to go super rugged, waterproof, very utility oriented. It's got to do everything it says it can do. It's got to look like it can do what it says it can do. So we really paid a lot of attention to, to feel, to the textures, to the rubber, to the right durometer rubber, how, how soft it is. A lot of other battery packs say they're waterproof, but they have a little door that you have to flip open and plug in something. But as soon as you flip that open, it's not waterproof anymore. This is waterproof without any flip doors. It doesn't need any special kind of enclosures or whatever to stay waterproof. It's waterproof. The power of the Venture is, is, is pretty impressive. You know, we've got 30 watt hours in a pretty small package. You'll see others kind of small, but they won't usually be rugged. They won't be waterproof. This thing can charge it up to three amps if the source will support it. Um, and that allows us to charge really quickly off solar um, or any other you know, existing USB source. We have two USB port outs. Um, and they're both 2.4 amp, which is kind of the new standard of, of USB. So you can run 2.4 out of both ports simultaneously. On this product, we have a feature where you press a button. It'll run through a, a bunch of different uh, possible charging scenarios. And then it'll, it'll stick to the one that was the fastest. That way you're getting optimal charge in, optimal charge out, because you've got the right profile for the right device. When we design things, we don't just think, okay, what's the next battery pack? I go out and I live life and I'm like, what do I need today? What do I have today that's not working for me? You know, I have, do I have a tablet that just can't get enough power off a traditional charger? Well, this can power a tablet, you know, but what's next? What, what other needs do I have for power that we, we're not solving yet here at Goal Zero? And that's where I think, that's where my mind is when I'm designing the next product.